In case you don't know, the shocking news that has happened in the past 24 hours to 36 hours, India fired an unidentified object, which is a BrahMos missile, and it crashed inside Pakistan territory near Mianwali. Now, these are the facts of this missile traveling at 40,000 feet at speeds of Mach 2.5 to 3. Total flight duration was 5 to 6 minutes in total. The BrahMos was not armed with a nuclear warhead. Still, it damaged when it crashed nearby residential plots. It was shot down by the Pakistan army. At the time of the flight, of the BrahMos, there were several passenger airliner jets, namely from Qatar Airways, Saudi Airways, and many other airlines in the airspace flying at 39,000 feet at the same altitude. This is an act of war. Pakistan should fire five missiles back into the Indian territory for retaliation in return. But are they going to do that? No. The pathetic Pakistani media news channels broadcasting without research and development, listening to Indian media news networks across the border, said that a JF-17 was crashed and how silly and unprofessional that these Pakistani media can get. And also criticizing the JF-17 for no reason, without justification. All the facts are, have been extracted from the ISPR briefing. In return, the Pakistan government asked for answers for this missile rogue going out of control into our territory. And the response we got today says, in the course routine maintenance, a technical malfunction led to the accidental firing of a missile read a statement issued by the Indian Defense Ministry in New Delhi. The government of India has taken a serious view and ordered a high-level court of inquiry, it further said. It has learned that the missile landed in the area of Pakistan. While the incident is deeply regrettable, it is also a matter of relief. There has been no loss of life due to the accident, read the communique. The explanation from the Indian government comes a day after the GGISPR revealed at a news conference. Now, there are two points. If they didn't respond, then we have the right to fire missiles into their country in within 24 hours. So they had to make an, a statement. And secondly, if they didn't answer, then we have the right to go to UN and make an issue out of this. Because this is the act of war, straight up. The link to the source article are given inside the video's description box. However, the 420 point of this missile being fired is basically the engineers at the Indian military facility want to test how fast the Pakistan defense missile shield can defend or shoot down incoming missiles. So now they know the estimate time is about five and a half minutes to six minutes, which means they are going to have to make a missile now in three minutes to reach its destination because it's a hypersonic missile. So there you have it. They were just trying to figure out what is the response time. And now the they have their answer. But they also know that the defense of the Pakistan army is pretty strong. Click like if you like the, today's video. Click the red button to see more of the videos and hope to see you next video. Enjoy this video? Then must have a look at these videos.